Grasslands are vast, open habitats found on all continents but Antarctica. Depending on how they're defined, grasslands cover 20 to 40 percent of the planet. They occur when there isn't enough water to sustain a forest, but not too little so a desert takes place. Tropical grasslands, also called savannas, are typically found around the equator. Temperate grasslands are found north and south of the equator. There are few trees in grasslands, all scattered away from each other. As a result, Large herbivores such as elephants, bison and zebras graze here. They shape the land by eating tree saplings that could slowly make areas of forest, thus sustaining the grassland. Large animals would have more space to roam freely, so mass gatherings are fairly common unlike in forests. There are two main types of grasslands, decided by their location. Montane grasslands are located in the mountains. The largest grassland in the world is the Eurasian steppe and it stretches from Hungary to China. Chavolsky's wild horses are the only true wild horses and are making a great comeback across the steppe. Saigo are once more abundant than wildebeest, but disease and poaching dramatically reduce their numbers. Eastern Imperial Eagles aren't fussy eaters, with 200 to 300 food options. Peekers do not hibernate, but are most active before winter to collect food supplies. Brown bears are keystone species by controlling animal populations and spreading seeds of plants. Wetlands are quite saturated grasslands typically with bodies of water near them. Located at the base of the Himalayas, the rich Teradwar savannas are an example of a wetland and are where the tallest grasses on earth are. Just the trunks of the Asian elephant alone could contain a hundred thousand different muscles. Bengal tigers are the apex predator of the region and they account for half of the wild tiger population. Gores are the largest members of the cattle family, reaching 8 to 10 feet in length. Despite their massive size, Indian rhinos can jump and have been clogged at speeds of up to 30 miles an hour. Hanuman Langurs are named after the Hindu god Hanuman and have adapted to live in cities. The wetland subspecies of Barasinga has adapted to a wetland habitat by feeding on aquatic vegetation. The Serengeti savannas are located in East Africa. 80% of the region is protected and it is a popular tourist site. Yearly, 2 million gazelles, wildebeest and zebra migrate clockwise around the Masai Mara and the Serengeti. Unlike all other cats, which normally live alone unless with cubs, lions live in groups numbering around 30 lions. Cape buffalo herds can number from 50 to 500 to confuse predators and they can reach the thousands in rainy seasons. Cheetahs can change their speed from 0 to 60 miles an hour in just 3 seconds. When threatened, giraffes can unleash a powerful kick that can break a lion's skull. Secretary birds are birds of prey that stamp on their food and eat them. They even eat venomous snakes. Covering 20% of Brazil and half its species only found there, the Cerrado is the most biodiverse savanna. Jaguars are strong hunters, even taking down the largest and deadliest animals in the region. Great areas of flightless birds that can reach speeds of up to 35 miles an hour. 
Brazilian tapirs have remained pretty much unchanged for the past 20 million years. Giant anteaters have tongues up to 2 feet long to get ants. Peccaries live in family units that aren't afraid to attack big cats to defend themselves. Desert grasslands are typically dry and with moderate amounts of rain. North Australian savannas are six times the size of the UK. Red kangaroos are the largest marsupials and can hop 25 feet in one leap and swim. Wombats have backwards facing pouches so sand doesn't get into the pouch when digging. Emus have two sets of eyelids, one for blinking and one for keeping the dust out of their eyes. Frilled lizards use a frill to scare or intimidate another animal. Echidnas are one of two egg-laying mammals called monotremes, the other being the platypus. The Great Plains in the USA and Canada were once a vast landscape. Today only half of the original grassland remains. The American bison is the largest land animal in North America and 30 million once grazed on the plains. Pronghorns are the second fastest land animals. They can reach speeds of up to 53 miles an hour by over several miles. Research has shown that prairie dog vocabulary is more advanced than any other animal language decoded. Large ears help the jackrabbit to listen out for predators, then they'll dash in a zigzag pattern to escape. Unfortunately, rich soils and open landscapes have made grasslands favoured by agriculture. A rapidly growing human population has forced the wild to make way for towns and cities. An imbalance in the food chain in some areas has resulted in overgrazing. Herbivores are being overhunted by humans and without them, the ecosystem will overall turn into wasteland. Climate change also helps the land to slowly turn into desert. Conservation efforts and protected areas are helping to restore biodiversity in grasslands. You can help grassland conservation by visiting websites like ourplanet.com or adopting an animal at WWF. If you like this video, like, subscribe, Click the notification bell and check out other videos on our channel.